Well, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, AOC, she is calling for all Trump supporters to be held accountable when essentially blacklisted for daring, daring to speak out against the election in a negative way. That hurts Democrats' feelings. We're going to get into all the details, guys. Before we go any further, if you enjoy the daily content I provide for you here on YouTube, I encourage you, you can help support the channel over on Patreon for as little as $5 a month. Patreon.com slash conservative truth. That link in the description gets you access to over 25 exclusive podcasts where I talk more about sensitive information. Plus, you get the alerts for anything that goes out there on Patreon, unlike YouTube. You guys are not going to be notified of all the videos that I put out, even if you have that bell selected because YouTube doesn't like me. But I know you guys do like me, so when you get done watching me here, browse back and check what you've missed. Please like this video, share it, hit the bell, subscribe, and wear the glasses because I'm blind. AOC. So what is she up to now? Well, she's calling for any of you Trump sycophants who are out there claiming fraud, speaking anything negatively about our democracy and how our elections work. She wants you blacklisted, especially if you took a paycheck from the Trump administration in any way to help promote his evil agenda. The fact that he's trying to undermine our election, our values. She is absolutely furious. She put out a post on Twitter saying, is anybody documenting these Trump sycophants who are out there spreading this false information? We need to hold them accountable. And well, Democrats responded. Now they're launching the Trump Accountability Project where they are collecting names of all those who have supported Trump, that have helped, you know, who took a paycheck from him, that helped him along the way. They want them barred from being able to get employment anywhere. They want to basically just completely remove them from society all together. And they're so proud of this. They're collecting names. They're putting them on their little list. It's like they're Santa Claus, right? They're making a list. They're checking it twice. They're trying to find out who's collecting checks from Trump and who's naughty or nice. Who's coming to town? Not Santa Claus, but the Democrats. The Democrats, and especially if it holds that Biden, by some chance, this actually stands, even though the media has called him to win, I don't believe it for a second, but if it were to actually happen and their dream comes true, you could then really bet that any conservative on Twitter, on Facebook, any other you know social media platform, pretty much your good is gone because they're not going to allow us to speak. They are trying to take our, you know, our rights away from us now even with Trump still there. Imagine what they'll do with him gone. Uh, it's not going to be pretty. Now, AOC has received a ton of backlash from this, you know, from conservatives, even some Democrats that aren't, you know, as extreme as she is, that said that, you know, you're collecting these lists. You're like, this is nothing but a fascist attempt that you're trying to do here to take control. This leads to dictatorships. This leads to tyranny. That's exactly what this is, ladies and gentlemen, at its finest. And these Dems are not going to stop until they get what they want. But I believe that God is still in control and he's going to put an end to this. We're going to start to expose and unfold the corruption as this whole ordeal continues to play itself out. So don't lose faith. We're not out of this yet. People like AOC, remember, those who deny Christ right now, every knee will bow and every tongue will confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. That includes all of these radical Democrats that are out there trying to persecute Christians, trying to, you know, implement their new world order agenda. It's all going to come crashing down. It's already been written, ladies and gentlemen. We've already won this thing. But let me know what you think in the comment section. I'll have more information on this in the description. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you. And I'll talk with you soon.